Hi friends, welcome to TurboMath channel. In this video, we are going to solve three questions about PEMDAS rule. In the first question, we have negative 3 plus 3, then times negative 2 plus 2 times 5. What is the answer of this question? In the wrong way of solving this question, some people solve this question like this. They start from the left and they don't pay attention to the priority of the mathematical operations. Negative 3 plus 3 equals 0. 0 times negative 2 plus 2 which equals 0, then times 5. They say 0 times 0 equals 0, and 0 times 5 equals 0. Again, some people solve this question like this. They say negative 3 plus 3 equals 0. 0 times negative 2 plus 2, then times 5. Again, they start from the left and simplify the question. 0 times negative 2 equals 0, 0 plus 2, then times 5, 0 plus 2 equals 2, and 2 times 5 equals 10. They say the final answer of this question equals 10, but this answer is definitely wrong. Let's solve this question step by step together. To solve this question, we need to follow the order of operations which is PEMDAS. PEMDAS shows the priority of the mathematical operations. If you don't pay attention to this rule, you get the wrong answer. Okay guys, in this rule, P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, A stands for addition, and S stands for subtraction. Multiplication and division have the same level of priority, also addition and subtraction have the same level of priority. When we have both in an expression, we start from the left and simplify the question. Okay guys, in this question, we have addition and multiplication. According to the PEMDAS rule, first we simplify this multiplication because the multiplication has higher priority than addition. Okay guys, 3 times negative 2 equals negative 6. Now the question is negative 3 minus 6, then plus 2, then times 5. Okay guys, in this step, we have subtraction, multiplication, and addition. First, we simplify this multiplication. 2 times 5 equals 10. Now the question is, negative 3 minus 6, then plus 10. Negative 3 minus 6 equals negative 9, and negative 9 plus 10 equals 1. The final answer of this question equals 1. Okay guys, if you're ready, let's solve another question about PEMDAS rule. Open parentheses, 2 plus 1 plus 1 close parentheses, then all of them to the power of 2, minus 3 times 4 plus 8, then over 2 to the power of 2 times open parentheses 1 plus 2 close parentheses minus 2. What is the answer of this question? Can you solve it? In this question, we have parentheses, addition, exponent, subtraction, multiplication, and division. Again, to solve this question, we need to follow the order of operations which is PEMDAS. PEMDAS shows the priority of the mathematical operations. In this rule, P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, A stands for addition, and S stands for subtraction. Let's simplify and solve this question step by step together. We have 2 plus 1 plus 1, then all of them to the power of 2 minus 3 times 4, then plus 8, and in the denominator, we have 2 to the power of 2, then times open parentheses, 1 plus 2 close parentheses, then minus 2. Okay guys, according to the PEMDAS rule, first we simplify the parentheses. Inside the first parentheses, we have another parentheses, addition, exponent, subtraction, and multiplication. First we simplify these parentheses. 2 plus 1 plus 1 equals 4. Now we have 4 to the power of 2 minus 3 times 4, then plus 8. Okay, guys. In this step, we have exponent, subtraction, multiplication, and addition. First, we simplify this exponent. 4 to the power of 2 equals 16. Now we have 16 minus 3 times 4, then plus 8. Now we have subtraction, multiplication, and addition. According to the PEMDAS rule, in this step, 
We simplify this multiplication. Negative 3 times 4 equals negative 12. Now the question is 16 minus 12, then plus 8. Okay, guys. Inside this parenthesis, we have 16 minus 12, then plus 8. 16 minus 12 equals 4, and 4 plus 8 equals 12. The final answer of this parenthesis equals 12. Now the question is 12 divided by 2 to the power of 2 times open parenthesis 1 plus 2 close parenthesis then minus 2. Okay guys, again we simplify this parenthesis. Inside this parenthesis we have another parenthesis. 1 plus 2 equals 3. Now inside this parenthesis we have 2 to the power of 2 times 3 then minus 2. Now we have exponent, multiplication and subtraction. First we simplify this exponent. 2 to the power of 2 equals 4. We have 4 times 3 then minus 2. Now we have multiplication and subtraction. First we do this multiplication. Because the multiplication has higher priority than subtraction. 4 times 3 equals 12. Now we have 12 minus 2. And 12 minus 2 equals 10. Okay guys. Now the question is 12 divided by 10. 12 divided by 10 equals 12 over 10. Now we have 12 over 10. 12 over 10 equals... 1.2 The final answer of this question equals 1.2 Okay guys, let's solve another question about PEMDAS rule In this question we have 3 to the power of 2 minus open parenthesis 8 minus 1 times 2 close parenthesis Then times open parenthesis 8 minus 1 close parenthesis Minus 3 to the power of 2 What is the answer of this question? Again to solve this question we need to follow the PEMDAS rule Guys, if you want to get the right answer of this question, you must follow the PEMDAS rule. P stands for parenthesis, E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, A stands for addition, and S stands for subtraction. According to the PEMDAS rule, first we simplify this parenthesis. Inside this parenthesis, we have subtraction and multiplication. First, we do this multiplication. Because the multiplication has higher priority than subtraction. Negative 1 times 2 equals negative 2. Now we have 8 minus 2 inside this parenthesis. 8 minus 2 equals 6. Now the question is 3 to the power of 2 minus 6, then times 8 minus 1, which equals 7, then minus 3 to the power of 2. Okay, guys, now we have exponent, subtraction, and multiplication. First, we simplify this exponent 3 to the power of 2 equals 9. Now the question is 9 minus 6 times 7, then minus 3 to the power of 2, which equals 9. Now we have subtraction and multiplication. First, we simplify this multiplication because the multiplication has higher priority than subtraction. Negative 6 times 7 equals negative 42. Now we have 9 minus 42, then minus 9. Okay, guys, because we have negative and positive numbers on both sides, we simplify and we get the final answer of this question. The final answer of this question equals negative 42. Guys, if you want to get the right answer of this question, you must follow the PEMDAS rule. And if you don't pay attention to this rule, you get the wrong answer. To see more mass videos, subscribe to the channel. Goodbye.